purgatory, a place to wait while you're being judged, whether they decide you go up or down. But to me, it's simply another night or a few nights of camping. If you, if all of us even have the same purgatory. What's going on, folks? Shades here. And I thought I was done with my late night audio show, but late in the night, ironically, I was reminded of this place, Purgatory. I laid here in bed, and it just the idea just came to me. For some reason, at that hour of the night. So yes, Purgatory. A place where you, where you supposedly wait or they decide whether you go to the kingdom of heaven or the to the lake of fire. And supposedly also whether you're stuck on earth. But which isn't so bad. Look after your family, protect them. In this new afterlife of yours, do what you want. You know, I personally you know, I talked to the big man himself, and I was like, you know, you got up there covered. Uh, way below is already covered, and we don't care about. So you need someone to take care of the middle. And I asked to be Earth's, and I was asking, can I please be Earth's protector? Supposedly red orbs protect people. Then let me be or become a red orb. You know, I want to protect the innocent do what I want in my free time, and in my free time, in my afterlife, I'm still trying to be a good guy. I'm still wanting to protect the innocent. You know, a lot of people don't know how to drive, and <laughs> that's why Earth needs more angels. You know, not to, uh, you know, to protect, not to collect, okay? <laughs> But yeah, purgatory, seriously. A place to wait while you're being judged. And, um, you know, it's really, it's not so bad to me. Because, you know, whenever I'm in the forest, I feel like I'm already there sometimes. You know, and, um, I want to know in the comments below. Because it's easier than taking in phone calls. Uh, if you ever had dreams of purgatory. Or what do you think yours will be like while you're waiting and chances are, well, when it comes to being judged, it's either you're in purgatory waiting, or you might be lucky right away to be in front of whoever, and whether the gate's open for you or not. So that's... So that just seems to be how it is. Only the big guy knows how... It works and the rules in his kingdom of pure happiness a lot of negative people on the in on earth don't believe just because life isn't going their way you know or just because they try to tries to make them look tough and you know you know when you're staring and their attitude will change you know the day comes when they're staring God in the face but before that you have to stare death himself in the face you know also a friend of the Lord above and I've spoken to this on another episode check it out you know the Reaper collects he is not offing you he is never I believe he has never offed none of you he just collects brings you to the Lord and um, or the gate and then they decide or the other possible way, if you're not one that gets to go straight to the gate, purgatory. This place. I hope it's a peaceful purgatory for good people, you know, and yeah. That's pretty much all I have to say right now about purgatory. Um, it's just basically a place in waiting. And, you know, on earth, you wander around as a spirit while waiting. 
which is entirely different and it's not as scary because I told you in many other videos like or you know ghosts are stuck on earth they probably didn't even make it to purgatory yet which is understandable you know why a lot stick around don't you they're afraid of the light because of judgments and where it might send them might not be so happy you know and that's probably why most of them spirits are stuck on earth you know that's probably that's why most spirits are stuck on earth afraid of where judgment might send them after being judged you know and some of them are attached to family or that you're so used to earth you just don't want to leave but supposedly if you wait too long it gets worse for you you know you know I'm just sticking to purgatory if you want I already said what I had to say about ghosts on my my other episodes I can go on and on about those forever I have so much info about that and experience um, which people don't realize um, a lot of times I left myself while laying in bed and I looked down and sometimes I've had times where I looked at myself in bed while outside of myself you know and people <laughs> people wonder how I know what they're doing um so per let's focus on purgatory it's just a place in waiting it's just like as one more mention of ghosts it's just like as a ghost life the afterlife is a waiting room man you know it's like you're on earth while you know a waiting room waiting to be go waiting for the light to come back waiting to go to heaven um you know it's just life for a ghost can be one big waiting room purgatory is the next step i th and then you know and then up or down and that's it you know and that's probably why a lot wander down like wander around down here because they're lost they don't know that they are not alive anymore they don't know and you know and when you see ghosts throwing stuff at you they're most of the time they're not violent they're just wondering what you're doing in their house so and they're trying to get you to leave because they don't know it's your house now you bought it and sadly they they think they're still alive but anyways yeah it's just a place in waiting purgatory no need to be scared, man. You could be alone. You could might have things with you that you have to run from while waiting or not. But purgatory, it's just a place. It's like when you're grounded in your room and all your friends go home and you never see them again. You know, it's just it kind of feels like that, you know. Not allowed to leave this one spot, I think. You could walk around, but I don't know. I haven't gotten that far yet, but I have somehow left myself and made it all the way outside this big, beautiful brown door. And I think in the clouds, yeah, you know where it goes. And I heard music. Um, and I don't even know if I'm supposed to mention that, but yeah, I keep thinking about that day. So yeah, now you know what purgatory is, or you could look it up on Google and are on Wikipedia with some unprofessional's opinion. Um, yeah, and that's pretty much it, you know, a place in waiting. You think about your life and all the paths you took, all the choices you made. I mean, and whether you go up or down, that's judgment and how you lived your life. So try your best. Nobody's golden. And I'm rooting for you because, you know, we're all in this together. And tune in next time. And you're lucky if you're into ghosts because I'm going to continue other ghosts that I didn't get to that are not on land. See you next time.